Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is Helton's Computer Repair here with another video for you. So you've been having problems and you've been trying to install OBS Studio or technically you possibly installed OBS Studio but somehow this program does not want to work correctly. So pretty much you probably got to try to install and you're in process and you're trying to press run and you saw this error and technically you press no. I'm going to go ahead and press yes first and let's go ahead and try this again to show you. You press no and we pretty much went to the same process, yes. And then we press next and we press no and now it doesn't want to work. So technically you don't know what to do, it pretty much gets a glitch. Or somehow this program got installed and now it doesn't want to work. The main part that you're going to be needing for this program is to have the Visual Studio 2019 runtimes for this to work. It pretty much tells you Visual C++ 2019 redistributables that is not currently installed. Right here, my system is a 64-bit. To make sure if your computer is a 64 bit, if it's like, then you'll pretty much go to this PC and you can right click on select properties. You can find out right here. Mine's a 64 bit, right here where it says system type 64 bit operating system x64 based processor. That would be the first thing that you would think that it is when they gave it to you, and that's pretty much the concept. Now, technically, if it does not want to work, and uh, because that link of 64 bit doesn't support your system, it's a little bit different because yours would possibly be called that is a 32-bit operating system or an x86 based processor depending on your type of computer. So we understand you might get that same concept of trying to get this program to work. So if it comes to that point and you somehow got to this one right here that came to Visual Studio 2019 run times 64-bit, um, just be sure you just change this to 32-bit and technically I'm going to go ahead and give you these things for it too. It will pretty much come to the same locations. So if you have the 32-bit, you'll select this same thing, the Visual C++ 2019 redistributable. 32 bit depending on your system. Mine again is a 64 bit, so I'll select this one. From that point, I'm going to go ahead and just download this file. Go ahead, once it's done, go ahead and open it. And you'll probably come to this point. I'm pretty much going to go ahead and just exit the browser, but I don't need it anymore. You will need to agree to this license and term and conditions for this to be installed. You will need this program for it technically to work. So if it comes to a point, go ahead and press yes. If it does show you and tells you that this program is not accepted, blah, 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 just try and find a way and just run it anyway. You will need that for it to work. And here it is, it's pretty much the Microsoft Visual C++ um, Restributable has pretty much been installed and it says setup is successful. So I'm going to go ahead and press close. So now if I try this again and try to install the OBS Studio, I'm going to go ahead and press yes, it's going to be prompted. And by this point you would think that I'm going to press next and the air is going to come up. It is not going to. I'm going to press next and voila, you're able to get this program installed and that is pretty much how to fix this problem where your OBS does not want to be installed on your computer. Thank you for watching from Helton's Computer Repair and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching guys. If you just like this video then hit that button but if you like it and you want to see more hit that like button, get subscribed, comment and tell us what other tech videos you want to see. Consider checking out our merch store link in the video description and for the rest I will see you on the next video.